For the last 24 years, Christine Flayhive has been considered a missing person in Charlotte County, a mother who disappeared from her home without a trace. But now, detectives say they know what happened to Christine on January 4th, 1995. The uh, cold case unit has um, developed some uh, new witness-driven leads, um, and these leads are being examined um, at this time. Uh, we are now considering this missing person case to be a homicide. Christine Flayhive was last seen by her family that night after stopping by her dad's house for a brief visit and a ride home after a bike ride to the store. He drove her home, dropped her and the groceries and a bicycle off, and um, according to her daughter, uh, Christine um, immediately left on her bicycle and that was the last time she was seen by the family. Detectives believe the 42-year-old headed to a downtown Punta Gorda bar, a place where she was known to frequent quite often. That would be somewhat normal behavior for Christine uh, back in 1995. Uh, what was not normal was is that she did not return home. A missing persons report was filed the next morning, and detectives canvassed hospitals, businesses, bars, anywhere to find any trace of Christine. But despite all efforts, she seemingly vanished from her home and her family. Fast forward nearly a decade, with new information about Christine's disappearance recently coming to light. Detectives are back hot on the trail, trying to piece together the people and the places that can finally lead to answers. We believe that Christine Flayhive was murdered by someone that she knew. Um, we believe that Christine Flayhive was murdered um, by someone that frequented the same local establishments, the bar establishments that Christine uh, frequented herself. What's more is that detectives firmly believe Christine's killer still has a connection to the Punta Gorda area. There's a strong likelihood and a high probability that the individuals responsible for Christine Flayhive's murder and disappearance and murder um, are um, strongly associated with this area um, and with people from this area. Since Christine was a very social person who spent a lot of time on the bar scene, there's a very good chance that people who knew her and spent time with her have the information that could make all the difference in this homicide investigation. Being a small t city in 1995, uh, the local people um, hanging out at the same local establishments on a regular basis, someone has to know some information about Christine Flayhive and about her murder. And one phone call with information, large or small, could finally help bring this cold case to a close. For Southwest Florida Crime Stoppers, I'm Trish Rout.